What is up, everyone? My name is Chrono, and welcome back to more Let's uh, Take Chrono plays. Final Fantasy Tactics. It's, like, it's, it's something I keep mixing up, mixing up like Let's Play and the Take Chrono plays. It's the same thing. Take Chrono plays is just my name. All right, today we'll be doing the next story mission because most of the missions we have. By the way, I've been doing this a little bit off screen. I, you know, did the wanted like the help thing so I can get those out of the way, and I done this a couple times just so I can hopefully get things like so what we'll be doing a hot awakening the Royal Volcano has been active lately the Royal Mage Academy wants to hire researchers no experience needed must like heat so we're gonna do this this will also give us the guy gear I should explain that the guy gear how it works is this I go to Yolanda real quick. It's actually a thing. If you take damage, you get auto regeneration. So you do lose block arrow. But honestly, it's a lot more better. We're kind of getting to the point where block arrow is kind of pointless to us because. They, oh, you know what's funny? I just got rid of the shield that gives us shield bearer. So, and I, I did master two things. So we have unlocked Paladin and Fighter. So, what we want to do with a second human. I think what I wanted to do was have like a tanky ranged character, but I feel like that's kind of pointless. I might go hunter fighter to increase our damage. I think Paladin also is like well I will go Paladin just to build the bulk up a little bit. And honestly I love Paladin, so it's probably one of my favorite class to go. That's why we can't equip the headband, which is probably one of the best things. I had a lot of money, and I ended up wasting it because I bought a whole bunch of random items so I can feed it to the the animals, or the bees, the monsters we captured, but I kind of screw it up, and yeah, so now we're going to get Paul Lee, we're going to put all gauntlets on, and you know what, put it in spike boots. The Scarab, I believe, nullifies and mobilization and disarm, well that's actually really kind of good, and frog. That's not that bad. Uh, as for Marty, he's still the same, just mastering the thing. Chrono is actually a different. Oh, also Mont Blanc. Mont Blanc is now a thief because we mastered pretty much all of the Mog Moogle stuff that we can press learn right now. And so I decided to go to Thief to unlock the two classes there. And we already mastered one, and we're currently trying to master a steel experience. And counter, of course. Chrono is now a ninja. We have mastered every thief ability except for still weapon, still ability, and still JP, which we don't have the ability to do that. Oh, and thief combo, but we don't have the mithril thing. So he's going to go a ninja for now. So if we want to, we can actually put still on if we need to. We also have black and white magic if we want. Uh, other than that, Gilbert is a white mage now because we're trying to get the other new classes unlocked. And all he has to do is master protect, and we're good. And Tobarami. And Melora is currently... Actually, why do I not just equip... Uh, this. So you can get... Block Arrow for now. Also, something else off screen when I was doing a lot of stuff. There's a mission. Uh, this clan that uh, can spawn here and... You know. Thing. I fought, fought them and they have a whole bunch of monsters. I was able to capture one. We got the dragon. We got a fire uh, dragon, which is like a room, ram, room. Uh, so we have the dragon soul. So if we want to, we can go master that real quick. Uh, that thing has two of those dragons, a bomb, a red flan, and a rock beast. I tried capturing another one, but it just didn't work. I still don't understand how it works. I'm probably going to look into that, but for now, no swords and getting it up. That makes one of our characters useless. Also, off screen, I did, I think I can go to clan to show this off. But, you know, I did get what I wanted. I wanted charm, and we got it. Multiple times. I, I only bought one, but from doing like those side missions, we, that's where they won't move. No aim and night swords. That's good. Let's just go.
who but yeah you do want charm before going into this mission how uh, it's so hot how can I get anything done here that's quick this thing's not going to erupt is it There must be a crystal here. Butterflies. What are butterflies doing here? This place isn't like the last one at all. Maybe this crystal is different from the other one. I have to try it. That's the only way home. Funny, there doesn't seem to be a totemery here on guard. What? And spoke to Sir. Is this a September 2? This place, the whole shrine is a Totemma. So, our clan, as you notice, we're going to have four team members. So, B, Spear, what do you want to do? So, we're going to add Mont Blanc. Uh, Gilbert for a thing, and we'll want to help us master stuff and attack from range. Alright, so we're going to go through this clan, or these pot members. Destroy all targets. Alright, first thing you want to do is go to log cards and add charm. Because the gimmick of this fight is these things are going to inflict charm to you if I just took the stats. Nope. World of Gods, charms, targets, and weakens. So yeah, they will inflict charm on your teammates so they just fight each other and you only have four teammates so. Challenge, it's a little bit challenging, but if you pitch them, they can't do anything. They literally would just sit there and do nothing. We can't use aim and something else. Well, and charm. Charm, aim, and something else. Uh, nine swords. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, we can morph into bug. I want to go into line with because we can actually just use hand slap, which is a high damaging move. These things do can attack you if you're close enough, so keep that in mind. So now we have katana as a cryptid, and something that can help you is of course using totema. I didn't have this before, but as off screen grinding was able to give me enough judge points. So, we're good. Okay. Mont Blanc was able to kill all of them, except for one. Wait, weaken and charm. Attack minus. What? We didn't. Huh. That's strange. Well, then again, he never inflicted charm. That's strange. They almost never use that. Oh, well, this playthrough has been the weird one, I would say. Ah, I wonder which new, uh, not new move, uh, 
Which uh, race does this get added to? Charming? Hmm. The time of presence is gone. It's not Numa, I just actually missed it that. Oh. The Totema pamphlet said he was born with the Mughals. I wonder if this crystal is allied with one of the races. And if it is, which one? The t thing around the crystal formed a magic circle. Magic. Hmm. The new move showed him. Yeah, it's a new new news. <laughs> you thought it was VRS. Actually, I did too. I could've sworn this one was a VRS. Who's there? Who's that? Why are you making me remember these things? Stop it. I said stop it. Stop mute. Mute? Not mute. <laughs> Mama's not dead. Mama's alive. She was just here. Who's trying to break my world? Get out. Get out of my world. No, I actually thought this was the uh, Viera one. I'm like, oh, it has Charming. So the thing, but nope. It's Numus. Mute. Prince Mute. My world. This world must be a reflection of Mute's desires. His mom's still alive. Everyone does what he says. I'm living inside Mute's dream. So if I can change the world back to the way it was, am I destroying his dream world? No wonder he doesn't want me here. Yep, new moves can use it now. Alright, hot awakening cleared. Mont Blanc mastered still experience. Here we got a thief hat. Now we don't need this. So we can add Corrin Wards, which we want to put that on 17. I don't know where 17 is. Uh, 17 is right here. Well, might as well get the treasure on here. This will give us nothing. No, it give us the material blade. This is what, if you have this thing set up, this is what you would get. I think it would have been that no matter what we, like, unless all three of these things are material blades, and that's kind of busted. Guess all greens. And lastly, we get a round shield. Okay, no one cares about that. But the material blade is what gives us dun 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 ultima weapon, or the ultima char uh, uh, charge and the ultima sword. Two of the most ultimate abilities, and that's how we can get it. So we can finally give that to Mont Blanc, and he's just gonna be. Wrecking fools. But of course he's trying to get thief stuff done right now. Anyway, let's go to Cyril real quick. And go to the pub. Rumors. Nothing. Mission. So this mission right here. Magic wood. The next story mission. This is where it starts some of the good uh, stealing Oh, things that you have a lot of good weapons you want to steal. So if you're trying to go for steal a weapon or still like Yeah, mainly weapon This is where you want to take a small break and then go grind up your negotiation as you can see Mine is only eight We need I believe 40 or 30 So I have a long way ahead of me and I am actually gonna go for it, but I'm gonna do something different than I did than I did on my Let's Play a long time ago. I'm not gonna be grinding with my main uh, clan. I'm gonna be using the other team members. My clan will be the ones being dispatched. So they can master stuff that way, but they don't get experience, they just master abilities. Except for Chrono, he's pretty much useless. So I'm not over leveled, but I still have good items. So I do wanna keep doing Metal Hunt, because this is one of the things I do. He's a lowest level. Uh, well, he's not a lowest, but we'll send out. 
What's it not Marty, I guess? Alright, so we have enough time to do one more mission. Uh, this one we're going to send out. Send out Yolando. This would be another area we free. And yeah, hot recipe. Tower of Ruins. Diamond Sword. Ooh. SOS. Has to have level 27 to rack. I don't think we have that. There's really not any missions we can do. Uh, I guess if anything, let me look and see if any of these work. Okay, we can do Tower Ruins because it's not on this list of things you want to steal. So we're going to send this out. Gaul, the Knight of the Amber Eye, was out with the Mughal Lenny when they heard tales of the Red Armed Fiend. The Co in Corrines, the Hero Skulls, Chapter 1. Okay, that's something. So this wants us to go to Korean Woods, and most likely, no missiles and copycat. Alright, let's go. This is a hard one, boys. Not the mission, but copycat is really annoying. Oh, it's this mission. I, oh no, there's a mission just like this, where uh, you start down here and all the enemies start up here, and it's so annoying. Alright, so we want to have Chrono, of course. Oh, what is he? We got Woodville, so we're still mastering that. Mont Blanc? I don't think he has that mastered yet. No, he does. But I still want to master counter real quick. But by mastering two thief abilities, that unlocks juggler and gadgeteer. So we're gonna wait till we get uh watch we'll call it mastered. Uh yeah, I wanna bring you because I do want to get protect mastered and we're gonna get turbo MP done. Can't use missiles, so you could be pretty much useless. But I want to get the thing mastered. So I'm gonna use you, but you can still use spirit magic. Of course we have to have Lenny if this has a story to do with him. He's a thief, by the way, because I'm just also trying to lock the old stuff for him. And this is our first time with her. Let's put her in as well. Because everyone else is on missions. Anyway, let's start. The Red Arm Fiends may be gone with these woods now. But there's plenty of monsters to take this place. All right. I don't have your ladder to capture anything. So we're fine. Now how copycat works. I can't attack anybody. Well, we're just gonna wait. Also we have to tame I can show this one off. This does MP damage instead of actual damage. So I would say save that until you get to like Characters with a lot of mages, then use that. I think weight doesn't count, because if that was the case, that would suck. So, how copycat works? So, he just used Goblin Punch. So, we're fine. But if he would have used Attack, if we use Attack straight after, we get inflicted with a uh, thing. So, he used an ability. I can use attack and be completely fine. But the next character, Gilabulu, he can't use attack. And if he does, well, he gets a red card, but he's a monster, who the hell cares? But since he didn't do anything, I have to use charge. No, Market Lance. And there we go. And we did Mog Lance last, but we can use Attack this time. 
and be fine. See little Lenny, the hero? He's back, but he's not. He's a thief this time, and he's about to dominate. Alright, we can't do anything with you. Well, actually, I can use red magic to reset the thing and use barrier. Oh, so that's what I did. Okay, see, I thought barrier was a... Uh, there's this thing you get, it's like this red thing. Anything that's afflicted to you like magic, it's just reflected towards the opponent. So if someone did fire on you, it would just come back. I have damage MP, so it doesn't want to battle me. Only problem is, since I'm a mage user, any damage to me just gets inflicted back. Well, I'm counting myself. So. Ah, I missed. He has to take the long way around since... Yeah, so if you're still on the bottom and the enemy's up there, you have to walk all the way up there. And there's no way to attack them unless you have magic. So he can't attack with... Because I don't remember what the last thing was. I think it was the dragon that went... The only thing I have is... Thanks. So if anything, I'm gonna morph into the Lima. I thought of doing this one challenge, not really a challenge, but something just so I can improve my drawing is just draw something every single day based on something I did. Like, I've been playing Final Fantasy IX, just draw one of the Final Fantasy IX characters. I'm playing this right now, draw one of these characters. Just have some fun. I thought I can improve how to draw better. Alright, so he did flame last, I can use attack. Who's next? Mont Blanc. Alright. We will use Mog Attack, 44 damage and knockback. Cool. Alright, we can have Lenny over here. He can use Attack. Oh, he copied you. I'm gonna come right down here. Action, red magic, double cast, thunder. I don't think thunder counts as double cast. Like if I do double cast, uh, I'll end up attacking Mont Blanc or whatever. Doesn't count as copycat because I'm technically doing it myself. So I can use thunder twice. Hopefully killing off him. There we go. Now let's see if that gets me red card. If that does, that's stupid. Oh my god, I thought it did. But no. Well, fine. But I would say, if that's stupid if I can't use double cast on copycat. Now, it used red magic. I'm using spirit magic, which is not the same thing. But does it count as the same thing? It's both magic, but it's different. Okay, no, it doesn't. Okay, good. Is he gonna use Flame Breath to heal up the thing? Yes, he is. Ah, oh, today is gonna be a long day. It's only Sunday, too. But I think, uh, after this, I'm gonna just work on some small stuff and around 12 o'clock which that's in three hours I will stream for fall I want to try this for six this time 
Alright, Song, Hand Slap, can I attack you down here? I cannot. I can Poison Frog. I'll just wait one uh, more turn. <clears throat> Fire damage. Well, I'm low on HP. Now, whose turn is next? He's walking away. Alright, Chrono. Let me deal with this, uh... Dragon. Ah, uh, of course I missed. I shouldn't charge. Hold on, nothing attack, 40%. I don't think that's really worth doing. Or I could just use Mog Attack and do. Well, I'm just almost. Not the same now, but. I kind of knock him back because there's a wall against. Well, there's a wall. But he can do it. Alright, we can use double cast again. Magic double cast. Thunder. Thunder again. Hopefully this destroys the bomb and do a lot of damage to the dragon. If I had ice, well blizzard, that would have been useful. Well I didn't even care all that. I had more than 60 HP. For some reason, I thought I had rape here, but I don't. Spirit magic. Heavy dust. Yeah, because he's going to end up trying to heal himself. Alright, so we have only to deal with two more enemies, which this is going to be really, really useful. No, my thing fainted. Alright, hand slap. 48 damage. One enemy left to deal with. By the way, that's a Malboro. Um, Malboro? I did come across one of them. That's the Help Alant Sand. They have a whole bunch of monsters there. I was like, I could capture this, but. We haven't seen it yet in the Let's Play, and I don't want to capture something that we haven't seen. Oh, counter. Oh, he missed. And he's gonna walk away. Well, with the dash boots on Chrono, he can still make it there. I can use Dragon Breath, I can actually use Attack. He's not level up. He's not level 12. Action. Charge. Mark Lance. I have one. He's almost dead. And only people can go. Are these, but they're too far away. So the person who's going to probably finish him off is going to be Elena. Oh, nope. It's going to be... Malora. Spirit Magic. Slip Rain. I'm going to use Slip Rain just so I can slow it. And there we go. Can we level it up? And there we go. A hero. I wonder if I would be a hero like that. Well, he's on a team. He's right there. With his big red nose. 
And we got the Diamond Sword and the Defender. And Master Turbo MP and then Protect. I don't care for any of these. Benton. I don't think this is one of the hidden characters. You know, I have to double check. I know it's not, but for safety reasons. He is not. Like, I knew he wasn't, but for some reason, just his level. Anyway, we got another guy here. Oh, we got the restore. You know what that means, boys? That Rolf. No, what that means... One, we have that back. But Chrono has to go back to her thief. Because this gives us... Oh, wait, no, this is a sword. I thought that was a dagger. Oh, well, good. I thought that was uh, the dagger that gives us still ability. Not still ability, uh... Still JP. Alright, let's head back to... Sage Moon. Oh no, to the thing. Go to pub. Battle in Eisen. What is that? Oh, so this is uh, basically a mission to do with Lenny. That's kind of cool. Alright, so it's going to be a long time till the next episode because I'm going to have to do a lot of off screen grinding. Oh, and speaking of which. By mastering two, uh, what you call it? So yeah, by mastering, wait, what do we have? Three. Oh, okay, we have four. So by mastering three white mage and three black mage abilities, you unlock the sage. No, maybe it's uh some of the beast master. I don't remember. We unlock the sage. So we're going to switch to Black Mage to get the last ability so we have everything unlocked for the new moves. Immobilize, disable. That's all it does. We get that. Headband. I need two more I need. So this is absolutely a lot more better. But I think I'm gonna do this for the more defense. Put that on. Fortune ring and comments, I guess. And by mastering two archer abilities, you unlock sniper. And this is what has the highest attack growth. So you have to set her up. That. I thought that was something that, uh, like this gives us auto regen. Might as well get that. And spike boots. Auto regen. I was going to go with the uh, auto block arrow, but I think it's kind of pointless. Was. Anyway, that is it for this episode. So next time, we'll play Farm Fantastic Advance. Well, our funds will change drastically, like, hugely, as we're going to have a whole bunch of money. Our clan, uh, uh, well, on the part of, like, these characters, will most likely be higher level. And I will have gotten the weapon for still ability done. And I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you guys next time. Well, let's play Final Fantasy Tactics Advance. See you guys later.